what's going on youtube can you guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button man it don't cost you none it's free it's free like them edd checks you was getting yeah you know saying let's go woody woody rest in peace that's the topic we're gonna be on today a lot of you guys know the northaniel rapper woody from northern california rest in peace very popular when he passed away very popular still and i'm sure many of you know the story of woody and how he unfortunately ended his life there's another northern california rapper that some of you may not be aware of his name is a wax a wax is a popular rapper from the northern california area bay area um east coco county to be exact and he's affiliated with a lot of northaniels he was affiliated with woody he has some tatted on him he's affiliated with big tone he's affiliated with a lot of northern mexican rappers this dude happens to be a blood makes dope music i highly suggest you go check out a wax's music now he just recently dropped a song titled east coco a wax east coco is the name of the song Highly suggest you guys go check it out after you watch this video. The reason why I bring up AWAX and East Coco because he details some certain things in that song pertaining to the legend Woody. Now he says Woody left the will and that Woody allegedly committed some crimes and admitted to those crimes before he ended his life. And he admitted to those crimes in a video. And there's a video out there of him admitting to these crimes. And now you're probably thinking, why would he admit to some crimes that he never got caught for? Well, because his homeboys, his homeboy is doing life in prison and has been down for many, many years for this crime. I believe over 20 years, his homeboy has been down for this crime. And, it, and it's a murder. And if you guys know Woody's music, then you know about the homeboy Blackbird. Blackbird, Woody would always rap about. In his songs, allegedly, Blackbird was wanted for questioning for these murders as well. And Blackbird's uh, unfortunate tragedy death, death took place before they could even get to him. Now, the individual by the name of Snoop is Woody's homeboy. He's the one that's locked up doing doing life in prison for this crime Woody took his own life and when it happened they said he was having girlfriend problems relationship issues and now it's being brought to light that 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 is not the case that it was most likely because of him making this video admitting to the crimes that his homeboy is doing life in prison for and he took his own life now they're alleging that the mom of what he has the tape has the will and refused for many many years still refusing to put the tape out there of the confession allegedly alleged confession supposedly there's a tape out there and now man that's a real nigga bro now it ain't a real nigga for you to you know what i'm saying i mean we all know what time it is when we go do shit right and if the homie gets caught for something that you did you don't want him to do your time, you know what I'm saying? You don't want no one you no one to do no time. But I'm gonna keep it real, bro. If the homie gets caught and I don't, I mean Spencer, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, bro, like that's the part of the game, my nigga. You knew what time it was when you when you got in this whip, you know what I'm saying? You knew what time it was when we went on that mission. Now it's fucked up, don't get me wrong, it's fucked up, and I would do everything I possibly can to try to get homeboy out, you know what I'm saying, if I was in that situation. And, you know what I'm saying, money on the books, lawyer, everything, bro. Taking care of the family, everything I possibly could to help the homie. But I'm not going to turn myself in. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not doing that. I'm sorry. I, that's just part of the game. Call me a piece of shit on me. Call me this. Call me that. I'm, no one is going to turn their self in. Especially for a fucking life sentence. Like, it's just fucked up, you know what I'm saying? You, what, what I would do is, you know, get money for lawyers, do all this and that, and hopefully and pray he beats the case, you know what I'm saying? Of course, if he's innocent. But, unfortunately, that didn't happen for Snoop. He ended up getting life in prison, and this allegedly was eating the homie Woody, rest in peace, up so much that he made a confession to these crimes 
and before right before he ended his own life and he made a will do i believe a rex of course i mean why would he lie why would he lie and put this in the song and he says in the song he never wanted to put it out on front street and and you know what i'm saying for the for the motherfucking public to see but he feels that the homie should be free and he feels that the mom allegedly that has the tape of allegedly Woody confessing to these crimes should bring this fucking tape forward and let the homie out. You know what I'm saying? If the mom has this alleged tape of the alleged confession would just come forward, th there's a good possible chance that this this dude would be free. You know what I'm saying? Here in the near future. But for some whatever reason, she's not doing it. I don't know why. I don't know why she's not doing it. Um, maybe she will see these YouTubes in. YouTube videos and get a second thought. Maybe she would listen to A Rax's song and get us, you know what I'm saying? Do the right thing. And when I say do the right thing, I mean because that's what Woody's will was. That's what he wanted to do. He made this will for a reason. He created, he made this video recording himself before taking his own life in this confession for a reason. You know what I'm saying? This was what he wanted. This was his wishes. And when someone passes away, you have to you have to uphold their wishes. You know what I'm saying? It's the right thing to do. Rest in peace, Woody, a fucking legend. Where do you guys stand in this? Should the mom come forward with the tapes? Could the mom just nah put it away? Because I don't know. I was thinking about it. Like maybe she doesn't want to come forward with the tapes because maybe the victims' families could try and sue her and try to sue the uh, whatever left of royalties that the that Woody's music is making. Maybe the family, the victims would sue. Maybe it's a month. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Because the victims can't sue. The families of the victims can't sue. And if Woody's still getting money off his music, if the if, if, if the family's getting money off Woody's music, then they can sue for that money. You know what I'm saying? So maybe that's why she didn't want to lose the money that the Woody's music was making to the victims. I don't know. It's just a thought. What do you guys think? What is your stance on this? She should come forward and free dude as well as uh, if you were put in Woody's situation where allegedly he committed some crimes that his homie went down for. Would you turn yourself in for a life sentence? Let me know in the comments. Let's talk about it. I read all the comments. I reply to most of them. So drop a comment and let's see what's happening. It's the kid. Tap in. East Coco forever. I'm going to be East Coco forever.